So, I just came from weighing myself in. I fight at 160, 176, and I weighed in at 172.4. So that's a whole four pounds, and I'm good. So we about to do is I'm gonna go get me some food. I think I want some Jersey Mike's. I'm gonna go get me some Jersey Mike's. Go get me a coconut water from the corner store. And we about to fill up, man. I was about crusty than a bitch. <laughs> but all right, guys, bro. So we finally got done with the weigh-ins, and that shit was a fucking setup, bro. Let me tell y'all something, bro. The fight starts, the event starts at 630, and the weigh-ins were supposed to be at 4. So me, I'm thinking well, I'm going to go weigh-in. It might take a little 10, 20 minutes to weigh-in. No, this shit took 49 minutes to weigh-in, bro. It is currently going on 5 o'clock, my nigga. Good. Five o'clock and I have an hour and thirty minutes to eat my food and let that sit and let my food digest. Bruh, it usually take about two hours for your food to digest before you wanna start working out. And now I only have an hour and a half, bruh. So anyways, bruh, I think that shit was a setup, bruh. But I'm at Subway right now. Can y'all see it? Yeah, I think it's a little backwards. I'm at Subway, I'm about to go inside. I'm gonna show y'all what I'm gonna get. I'm gonna try to go find a corner store, buy some coconut water. I can't eat the fruit no more. And we're gonna see what I can do, man. Bro, I don't gotta... think y'all understand how happy a nigga is, bro. Hold on, bro. These niggas are walking in my car real slow, bro. She got a hand. I bet. Look, I don't feel comfortable over here, so we're gonna go ahead and move. We're gonna go ahead and move real quick. But I just came from Subway. The dude was cool as fuck. He gave me um he gave me a free drink. Well he ain't give me a free drink, but I got a free drink. You feel me? You know, I think he seen me sipping it and he asked, he was like, he was like, did you only want to he said, Did you only want the sandwich? So I just took it as shit. Hey, but he was asking me, did he want did he want to charge me for the drink or not? But I, I tipped him, I tipped him, so. So I basically paid for the drink, but I didn't pay for the drink. I tipped him. So I went to Subway. Damn, I flipped my sandwich over. I went to Subway and I got, I got a bacon chicken elite. Elite chicken and bacon. I put ranch, onions, and some lettuce on it. And I wish I would've got coconut water. I would've much rather coconut water, but this is cool. It's only 80 calories. You got a couple vitamins in it. I got two water bottles. And, bro, I'm going to eat, rehydrate, and I'm going to chill out. I'm going to chill out until the fight happens. So, yeah, I guess I'll catch y'all, boys.
stayed that long hey man only reason i stayed that long is because my boy my one of my teammates he had the fight and i wanted to be there to support him because he was there to watch mine so we stayed until the very he was the very last bout bro if you can't tell i'm tired as the fuck so anyways going over my first fight back um i was a hundred percent sloppy am i happy i got the win yeah i'm disappointed in my performance though i could have did way better i think the nervousness of my first fight coming back i did look in the crowd a little bit made me a little bit more nervous and when i seen the punches flying and the 12 ounce gloves oh my gosh that shit is so fucking different than a sparring match and everything just hit me but i'm happy i got the win um tomorrow i want to i want to go out there much more tamed much more form just i want to go out there me the usual me that I, I know i can do bro but i'm happy i got the win tomorrow i just need to lock in and just take deep breaths and just not be so nervous and worked up bro and not so scared of the punches bro man but first first day down second day we gonna i'm gonna catch y'all man i'm gonna win i'm gonna win i'm gonna win i'm gonna win i put it in the air bro <laughs> 